Hey guys, welcome back to another video. In this video, I'm gonna review the Tanix and White Box folks. This was sent to me by fellow YouTubers, Warhorse Reviews, Next Level Tech, and also the 69 Death Scott. And I just want to say a massive thank you for sending me this to review. Okay, so with all that being said, let's get started. to subscribe to Streaming Wizard's channel, ding the notification bell, press like on all of his videos, share the video, and follow him on all his social media. Alright guys, so let's see what you get in the box. Okay, so in the box you will receive the Tanix and white box itself, obviously, and if you look at the top of the box, you'll see it has a really cool pattern going on, like a diamond pattern. You also get um, an antenna to help with your internet connection and when you turn the box on a knock comes up just right here folks it tells in the time basically and then you've got a USB 3.0 port as you can see there you also get a power hole to plug into your power cable and that's where you plug your power cable and you also get a HDMI not to actually view it on your TV or monitor in my case you also get an Ethernet port or even it's not and you also receive two USB 2.0 slot and then you've got um something for audio um like a headphone sack if you look say your speakers right in there is this face it more than I need you not but if you do your speakers will pick up the sound of this box and if you turn it you have a S a TF cards not so not good and then we're back to the front okay so this Look in the remote console. Now in the remote console, it just, it's so white basic. Nay, um, it's a really basic remote. You've got your power, your mood, your volume consoles, your directional pad, your home button, your hamburger button, back button, the number pad, the pack back space, and then you also get a mouse button. And when you press the mouse button, it doesn't act like an air mouse. You've got to use the directional keys to, and um, like 
console and the mouse. So that's everything you get inside the box basically um obviously you get a HDMI cable so that's good and a power cable. Okay, so let me look listen into my capsule card and let's see what this box can do for us. Okay guys, so now you know what's in the box. Let's go and take a look at this. So this is the home screen sus right here folks. And as you can see it's a really really nice home game. So this up the case in here and this black one that's actually a fork of the K app folks. So that's built in so you don't have to install the K app. But I would recommend uninstalling their version of the K app and reinstalling um the official K app. So you also get the Google Play Store. That next, it's only gonna be standard definition. Chrome to download your APKs. So you go in Chrome, type in your URL and download the APK. And also you have YouTube. So this is the home tab as you can see just right there a little house that's how you know yeah at the home skin so if you go down to the four stairs you'll see all your apps some i have installed night at god for example but everything else is already reinstalled so you've got the play store a max player maybe the cast receiver music local update so if you have a one like an android 10 one or an android TV one, you can actually go to no cool update, pick that one, and install that custom one on your device. No, so you have Netflix, like I mentioned, the Play Store, your settings, which is really important, the TV center, which is the four of the K app VLC which is a media player and YouTube. So if I go to the Google Play Store looks like it's an Android TV version folks so you all Ringing limited on the Android TV first enough the Play Store and I don't seem to navigate for some reason, guys. So not a good sign for the Play Store, but thus you see I bought up the mouse, so swipe as in that mouse button that I talked about earlier and it's not an air mouse you've got to use the directional keys to you got to press the mouse button and then yeah console the mouse with the owl keys so that could be a real pain but 
they have it. And in some APKs where you're saying to access the top bar, you will need to use the mouse toggle to do that. Volts, because you can't do it with no remote. It's a pity, I know. So, YouTube. Let's say about the YouTube. And let's look up a video. Right, so I typed in 1080 60fps. It may not look as good because this is a 30fps video. But if I click on the 60fps 1080 video. And if I skip forward, right, so what I can see it's not playing great, but you may see different on the recording, it could be playing fantastic. What's in the is moving. Out in the dobe. That's playing pretty good, actually. And if I go to the three dots, go to on the T, it is in 1080. Before on this box, I couldn't get YouTube to work at all. Like, if I play the video, it's just one not. Nay, internet people not working normally, guys. But back out in that. I'll say one more. I'll go for now one. Why not? Nah. Um, there's an effort. Okay, so now that I've heard Finnis and here's the 1080p video. And as I can tell, it's working pretty good. Go to the three dots and see it this in 1080p. And that's Working real good. So for 1080p content, it works fine. I don't know what is like with 4K content, no. But as I can tell a lot, that's working fine. So, this little naggy, I've noticed, if I go home, and if I go there, just a little naggy, but I guess it gets the shop done. But, oh no. This is a really good box, folks. So if I go to settings, you also have the settings section. I forgot to mention, and in at yeah, apps now if you want to. So if I go to settings, and then. Go to device. Uh, about can see the device name is the TX6S. This is this box, and it's on my TV version 10. 
Um, you can see the security parts level in if you can insist in that. But if you go to stores, this box has a whopping 32 gig. So that's more than enough what you're gonna need, folks. You're never gonna fill it up. And on the box, you got 25 gig of that 32 gig available. So plenty of space for some. But oh no, this is a good box. I'll give it a. Uh, 7 out of 10, folks, because it does not in some areas. I think my favorite box now was next level, and nice and me, um, was being in CT King. That box is extremely like awesome. It's awesome the being in CT King. I'll then keep playing this at the end of the video so you can check my other and white box reviews and them. Um, I'm also gonna review another semen device in the future, but that's all for another video. I hope you have enjoyed this review. If you did, Please make sure to remember to subscribe to Streaming Wizards channel, ding the notification bell, press like on all of his videos, share the video, and follow him on all his social media. Okay, guys. Until next time, stay safe.